No, uh, you know, if I was going to spotlight the one book, like, you know, it is Once in Future, it launches in August by Kieran Gillen, uh, Dan Mora and company. Um, it is a beautiful book. Uh, you know, you know, Kieran, you know, Dan Mora's track record, right? Power Rangers and Buffy and Klaus with Grant Morrison. So this guy is just hit, 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 hit. And then, you know, Kieran Gillen from all this crazy Marvel stuff from Star Wars, from Wicked and the Divine, and we all know what Dai is doing right now, right? And so the pledge that we made to comic retailers on Once in Future is that we're only going to do one cover in comic shops because retailers keep telling us, you know, look, we don't want all these crazy variant covers all the time. We only want one cover. Make the book, you know, returnable for us. So we announced, you know, in an industry like uh, the uh, first time ever, every issue of Once in Future no standard variants. Like stores may still do their own variants, but like no standard variants going into stores. Every issue is to be returnable for retailers investing in it. And, uh, you know, we're going to make the collections returnable. I'm going to tell you right now, I look at what dies on what is fifth, sixth printing somewhere right now, crazy. Yeah. I'm, tell- I'm telling you, if I was a retailer looking at, at once in future, I'd say, let me put together my die numbers with like from ish printings one through five and see what I actually needed because this book is awesome. Um, it is, as someone who's known Kieran for 12 years, and I think he would joke with me that uh, his Aries miniseries, I always say, was like one of my favorite things. Uh, this is my favorite. This is my favorite, not only Dan Moore comic, because Dan's in Crow Arts, my favorite Dan Moore comic, but it is my favorite Kieran Gillen comic I have ever read. Kieran Gillen's amazing. Wicked and Divine is awesome. You know, Phonogram. Awesome. I love him and McKelvey. I love him and Stephanie Hans. I love him and anybody. He and Dan Mora, like just as a reader, are such a dream team. And I'm telling you, I don't think, I don't know if retailers can anticipate the demand for this because once people read this book, they are going to, they're going to be in. It, 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 it does. You remember what Kingsman kind of did for the spy world and India and, uh, and James Bond? This kind of does the same thing for Indiana Jones and that kind of adventuring kind of world. And it is so good. And um, my kind of bolo, if you want to call it this, is if you're really excited about uh, Once in Future, you're a big Kieran Gillen fan, make sure you come to the Boom Studios Discover Yours panel. Uh, at Comic Con, I can't remember if we're allowed to announce the date and time quite yet, <laughs> but we have a panel. It will, uh, if you're a Kieran Gillen fan, you're going to want to be at that panel because he's on it. But if you are interested in Once in Future, or and you like walking away from panels with something that no one else will ever get. I'm not sure if I'm being too subtle here. <laughs> you have to come to that panel. Oh, I you love have. It. To. So, um, and you know, there is. Uh, you have to, and if you're, a, and if you are a retailer, you have to come to the Diamond uh, Summit and speak with uh, Philip Sablick, our president of publishing and marketing, and. Uh, Morgan Perry, our direct market, um, she's our sorry, our, she's our sales coordinator and who handles everything direct market. Um, you got to come meet with them both. You're going to want to do it. It is a good investment of your time to be at the panel or meet with our sales folks because it's a good investment of your time. It will be a good investment for other reasons. Am I being too subtle, guys? No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's perfect. <laughs> be there. Because what will happen is these wonderful gentlemen here who may or may not be – are you guys at San Diego? I am not, unfortunately. I'm okay, East Coast, so I'm, uh, that's a long trip. Right. Anybody? Jack, you there? Uh, yeah, no, we'll be at San Diego okay. this year. So you can be Brian, Jack, and Andy and be boloing for something that you're not going to have. Or you can be at San Diego and come to that panel and get to rub it in Brian Jacks and Andy's faces. And if you do, tag me on Twitter. I'll retweet it to rub it in the face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, that's, that's a dirty move. That's a dirty move. <laughs> well, guys, guys, hotels are only $1,100 a night at San Diego right now. Come on. 